Hey guys, today I just wanted to show you my custom Halloween 1 NECA figure from the 1978 movie. And what I've done was I used the body of the 2018 NECA figure and the head sculpt of the Halloween 2 figure. And I'll show you how that's done right here. Okay, so basically what I've done here, I got the Halloween 2 set, I got it off AliExpress so it was cheaper, I know that we have the 2018 head in there, but that's because I didn't have room in that box. So basically I got the Ben Tramer mask, and as you can tell, the Ben Tramer mask, if you actually know anything about Halloween, oh, come on, focus, focus on Mikey, there we go, if you can tell, I know he has blue eyes and everything, it might take away a bit of the effect, I might fix that up later, you know, pretty sure... In some of the movies, Michael has blue eyes, in some of the movies, he has brown eyes. It really depends on what one you watch, but let's go with the canon timeline where it does actually have blue eyes. So basically, anyways, back to what we're talking about. The mask on the Ben Tramer mold is completely white. Very similar to the first Halloween one. I know that there's no, like, neck color there, but that doesn't faze me too much. And if you look on the side, you can see, like, this yellow thing. But that's because what I've done, this is the original mask for the Halloween 2 figure. The bleeding eyes on because that looks really freaking cool in my opinion. Um, so basically, I took the hair off of the um, took the hair off of the Halloween two one, and I basically just done a swap route. So it's Ben Tramer's hair with the original Halloween two mask. I know it looks crap. This is why it's from AliExpress. It's a bit like, and I basically swapped it around to make the Mecca the hat the. 1978 mask, so, so there we go, that's the mask, I think that looks pretty good, it could do a little bit of a touch up I reckon, I don't think I want to do the needle hole on the side, I'm not too keen on doing that, I just kind of want to leave it like this at the moment, so you know, nice and simple, you know we got the grave from the 2018 and the pumpkin from the 2018, basically I feel like the NECA people have done this, so they don't actually have the rights to make their own NECA figure, but I feel like they knew exactly what they were doing when they made this, so of course, the knife isn't the same as the lamps and knife that you see in the film, but the reason, so I actually, I do have, I do have the Halloween Kills set, which does have something very similar to the lamps and knife that was used in the first movie, but it's covered in blood, and I don't really want to take it out of my Halloween Kills set, because this is like an official one, and it looks beautiful, I still haven't done a video on this one yet, I think I will, this is a very, very, very good figure. I also have not done a review on Jason here, which when I put these guys next to each other, there's a big, big difference in height. So in Freddy vs. Jason, he's 6 foot 9 to 7 foot, and in the new canon timeline, Michael's only 6 foot 3. So I could make it a little bit more accurate by giving him the lamps and knife, not that it would really be that accurate because it doesn't have the same length and it's covered in blood, unlike what we see in the first movie, but I think that it just looks good with the classic black at the moment. I might touch it up myself just a little bit because I always like to go that little bit extra when it comes to making my props and all that kind of stuff, especially when it comes to custom figures. Um, I actually decided to make this one day because I thought about it for a while and I knew that we didn't have an official NECA 1978 figure, and I thought about how this could actually work, and turns out it does. So, there we go. This is the, um, this is the outcome. Halloween 1978, Michael Audrey Myers. And, yes, we do have the 2018 head sculpt, which is terrible. But remember, guys, this is from AliExpress. I'm going to buy an official version of the 2018, um because I actually want another one just to put up next to my kills. I'm not going to get another one of the Halloween 2, because basically I've already got the figure and he already looks pretty good. Like, perfect. Not perfect, but hey, it looks better than some. Um, so yes, this is basically my Halloween 1978 custom NECA figure. And I'm sorry that this video isn't as good as it could be. I'm trying to do a quick one. I've only really got one hand at the moment because I was in an accident and I almost died. Pretty crazy, but hey, I'm alive, so here we are. Um, I've got a couple more reviews based on Halloween coming in. I have a new mask, if you can see it in the reflection of the Halloween Kills one. I'm not going to spoil what it is yet. And I also have a light-up pumpkin that I'm going to do a review on as well. So, yeah, that, that's going to be pretty fun. Anyways, guys, thanks for watching. This is basically it. And, um, yeah, here we go.